Hey everyone, here's a quick demonstration on how to add a Flickr gallery. Dominic does a full walkthrough in a six minute video. You're going to be using Flickr. You should check that out. If you get stuck, here's a quick reference video. Maybe you'll be able to figure it out, assuming your Flickr is properly set up already. So you want to go to your dashboard. You do not want to be in easy mode. So on our free demonstration site, we have a photos page. This photos page is actually just linked to sub pages and then each sub page has its own gallery tag. Now you can always have multiple galleries on one page. It's up to you how you want to do it. This is just a simple screenshot with a hyperlink to that page. So I click on that and it goes to the photos forward slash first ride on our website. So then I can edit that page and then here I see the awesome Flickr gallery shortcode. So to set up a, a Flickr gallery, real quick, go to add gallery. One thing to remember is that photo set is our photo stream or gallery or photo set, whatever you have your photos in on Flickr is what's going to be synced up to your gallery on club hosting. So you give it a name and description. We're going to hit edit on an existing category to show you what it looks like. For example, we have First Ride on Club Hosting. We're mapping it to the photo set of First Ride 2012 on Flickr. Once that's all saved, we get a gallery code down here that we highlight and copy. And then we go back to our page that we want to add this gallery on. And we can hit Preview and Preview it from there. Now, you may not want to have big thumbnails like this of your photo gallery and you may not want to do sub pages for each gallery you want to add. If you feel like you're going to have an active club, it may get to be a little bit of a hassle if you're constantly adding new tags. So you can always create one gallery, put all your photos into one. We just did this as a quick demonstration on how to break it down if you want to get more refined and have more detail. Now if you have important pictures of an event, I would suggest creating an event page that talks about the event and then having a gallery added to that events page. Here we have a gallery tag shown three times just to show you that you can't have more than one gallery on one page so you can always separate it by some H2 text titles between the two of them. But it's just one of the ways to add Flickr photos to your website which gives you this neat little navigation on that page without actually having to leave your website where they can scroll through your gallery options. For the fully detailed video, please check out the Club Hosting YouTube channel, Flickr video, six minutes long, highly worth your time. Thanks. Have a good day.